Hey, before we get into this video, please check out Played on MC Arcadia, and don't forget to subscribe. Do you struggle with finding good bases? Well, look no further. I've compiled the best tips and tricks to finding any base in vanilla Minecraft. Tip number one, mods. A great mod for base rating is Zero's world map and minimap. Hit M on your keyboard to open up the map. And a great idea before base rating is to set four points as a search area. So here on the screen, I set four points as at 500 blocks. Now usually this number would be somewhere in the 20,000s, 15,000s, but for now, all 500 blocks. Pie chart is one of the most important tools in base searching. It'll allow you to find underground bases. Now the first thing you need to do is hold shift, then click F3. A little pie chart will show up in the bottom right of your screen. Now, look for the word that says tick. It should usually be the number four. Now hit four on your, your keyboard, like if you want to switch to an item in your hotbar. Now look for level. This will tell you the percentage of certain blocks and entities in your render distance, depending on which you select. Now, the next step you hit level is to find block entities and bang, you're done. This will tell you uh, entities loaded in your render distance. You can detect many blocks with this tool, but the best blocks to look for are ender chests, e-tables, activated pistons, shulker boxes, and any type of skull. A smaller tip that can help you pinpoint bases to the exact block is entities. You can either use F3 to see entities, or you can use an Optifine mod. Shown here is F3, and here, Optifine. Now, watch as I add entities pen. See, it goes up. You want to look for entity counts that are high, and usually above the, the, the normal amount, which is around 4 to 7. 25 to 40 might indicate a base. Okay, now that you've learned all of these tips, now you can finally use that information. So, what are you going to need? You're going to need an Elytra, rockets, a block to mark, food, and some protection, as well as a pickaxe. Let's say you're flying, and you find a base on pie chart, as shown in the video. Well, the first thing you need to do is unload that until it doesn't show up. Then, slowly load it in, either on the X or the Z axis. Find the chunk where it loaded in. Usually, you can lower your render distance to make this easier. In, case the, in, in the case of the video, I'm using render distance of 11. Now, unload it on the other axis. Once you have it unloaded, fly back until it loads in again, and make sure you make a visual note of the block that you just loaded in. Place a block there. Alright, now I'm going to the middle. Place a block. Then I opened up my chunk viewer. What this is going to tell me and you don't have to do this, but it's just going to tell me where the middle of the chunk is, and I'll I'll use that as a reference point to where I should dig down. Then I load my red to two to check even if I'm in the right chunks. So I brought that up to 14. Then I went over to the other corner to place a block because since it's a two by two zone zone, it's likely in these two chunks that I'm in. Now I go right in between. It doesn't matter where you dig down. You can dig down either on the glowstone if it's a precise point, or you can just dig down where I'm going since I'm gonna use entities to locate the base. I will speed this up so it doesn't take so long. going looking around so that direction there's 20 entities in this direction there's 64 which indicates there's a base there I mark the hole so that I can find it and fly out now I'm digging to where those entities are vertically you can also dig straight if you want but now you know it's on this Y level there bang found the base so now you can enjoy the loot and you can do this pretty much with any base, as long as it has an ender chest or high end count. There's my little victory dance. Thank you for watching. If 
you have any questions, comment them down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out Play.MC Arcadia. You can get some crazy raids on there. I'm on there. I'm raiding all the time. It's great.